alive again, spiritually alive, become born again, it calls the word in the Bible. Being born again of the Holy Spirit. It means you change from death to life. It means you come to be a child of God and you come into the new kingdom, the kingdom of the Holy Spirit and the kingdom of God. My friends, this world is passing away. This world is passing away. The foundations are shaking. The old is passing away and the kingdom is passing. The nations are shaking. America is shaking. Europe is shaking. It is all shaking before your very eyes. And you know what? Some of you, even if there was war in the UK, you still will not come to know the Lord. You still will reject Him. But yet He's still hanging His love out to you. He's still hanging His mercy out to you. He's still giving you His goodness and saying, Come to me while you can. Come to me while you can. And He still offers His love to you. He still offers His goodness to you. And He offers it to you. But as He offers it to you, the nations are shaking. Things are breaking up. America's breaking up. Europe is breaking up. It's all crumbling before your very eyes. And as you see it crumble, the last thing you're thinking about is God. The last thing you're thinking about is Jesus. But in the midst of that brokenness, in the midst of the national crisis in our nations, the thing that you need to be thinking about is eternal life. The need to, you think, to think about is eternal life. Amen. The need that you need to be thinking about is Jesus Christ. That is what you need to be Amen. thinking about. Because it's only Him, only He can help you. Only He can help you in a national crisis. Only He can help you in the time of war. Only He can help you in the time when the nations break up. Only He can help you. And Jesus says, come to me. All you who are weak and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon me and learn of me. For my yoke is easy.